Hey y'all, so I'm just doing a really simple 12 by 12 layout and this um, idea coming up came from Dear Lizzie. And so um, what I'm doing is I'm taking a round sponge and it's kind of more of a sturdy sponge. I guess you don't really need to have a sturdy one though. It's a pretty simple technique. And I just used white acrylic paint and it does show up on this white kind of cream, but it is a white acrylic paint. Um, and I'm just made the circles and then I'm drying that off and I didn't use much paint the less paint you use I think the better it works out um, So I'll continue to make sure that those are completely dry and then I am going to um, Add some I'm dabbing off some sponge sugar distress ink um, on my palette that I use and I'm just gonna take a I think it's a watercolor brush. I'm not sure um, and just go over it um, and hope that the white dots will, will um, resist it a little bit. And they do resist. Um, they do kind of get a little bit of a tan color, but I, I mean, I don't mind it. Um, so I'm going to take a little sponge and I'm going to dab off um, the excess on top of the dots. So um, I just kind of wanted a a different look and I don't and I've gotten to the point where I'm not using a whole lot of paper on my layout some layouts I still do um, but I'm really getting into the art part of scrapbooking so um, I'll switch it off from here from time to time though so now I'm going to take a stencil from Studio Calico and you guys probably have all seen this stencil and I actually just got this a few days ago in a, and I showed it in my haul video. But I'm just taking some mint green or what I thought was going to be turn out mint green. And I had yellow on my brush and so or on my sponge. So it didn't turn out as mint green as I wanted to wanted it to. But it was no big deal. It just looks a little more grassy green than I would have liked. But um, that's okay. It ends up working out. Uh, and so... I went ahead and stenciled that in, and then I'm taking the a black marker, just a micro, what are, or a micron pen, and I think it's like 0 0.5 maybe, and I'm just uh, I outline some of the triangles, and that'll go with the black ink that I use a little later. I have no idea what I'm doing now. Oh, okay, so this is the picture I'm using. And if you can't tell what that is, they are the best cookies ever. They're peanut butter uh, cookies with like a kiss, uh, Hershey's Kiss on top. And they're my favorite. So I thought I'd scrap about them. Sorry, this is not in the frame. But that, that paper is the Pier paper or a, a collect, from the Pier collection. And I'm just taking an old book page and I will have to get some of the spray that protects the pictures because of the book someone had mentioned that to me in another layout that I did um, so I will do that at some point so this is just a silhouette cut it's a free one by Heidi Swap I'm having a lot of trouble with these strips I'm not I can't figure out if I like the way that it looks or what the deal is and then so I go back to that here in a second and it looks like I'm going to use those colors, but I ended up deciding to just go with green, or kind of a green scheme since everything else, since the background of the photo has some mint green in it, and then the stencil does as well. So I'm trying to cut those down to get them even, and for some reason I always have trouble with these. I don't know why. I guess because I don't get them going in the same direction, but or the ends always face a different way. So, um, I do like the way that looks, so I go ahead and adhere that down. And this is about as far as my embellishments get on this page. Um, sometimes I, I feel like, for me personally, my pages look better when they have less on them. These are mini market stickers by October Afternoon. And I got those at my local scrapbook store. It's called Crop Paper Scissors. And I'm at my sewing machine now. Um, I'm sewing down favorite and cookies. And the 
chevron arrows there at the bottom so it's about to get really fast i'm sorry but i just added heidi swap and um, black velvet mist and i used i did that using a brush but that completes um the layout and i hope you guys enjoyed have a great weekend